So welcome to my channel AJ Studio. Uh, in the previous video we have seen uh, regarding C++ simple program. Today we will take some input and going to print that. So we will take some uh, uh, string uh, input and you are going to print that. We will see that and I am going to open Visual Studio. So here I have already opened the Visual Studio in the previous program I have told how to open it and how to type and how to create a new uh, project so let's start uh, coding so it's very simple always it should be header file so I should include oh you know what is the first uh, file uh, header file it is io stream you can see over here it is io stream so normally in c++ no need to give dot h uh, io stream is enough okay that's that signifies it is a header file and of course the second line you are using a, a, a namespace okay using namespace as td so this one is a namespace normally c++ will have a namespace uh, that is std that is standard uh, to avoid uh, uh, multiple name collisions you are using it it is a standard and even um, your c in and c out is defined inside std otherwise uh, it will show error uh, uh, i can show it afterwards uh, if i remove that uh, using namespace std what will happen so now we'll go to int main so int main i'll open the bracket okay and open it and i will close it so now uh, int main I have opened the main function now I'll uh, try to uh, print something and I'll take input from the user I'm going to print something okay so how can I do that so C out okay and uh, you are uh, going to use um, uh, that is a redirection symbol so C out normally it is less than that means op uh, uh, opening will be in front of the right side so C out that is you are printing something C out means so console output so C out means console output so now I'm going to print something so I'll give as uh, double quotes enter your uh, name okay enter your name I'm, I'm going to close it normally we'll give slash n uh, here uh, okay just wait a minute slash n slash n means next line instead of that now uh, C, C++ has some uh, nice uh, features uh, again redirection symbol okay the same thing end line end line means you are ending the line that means uh, which acts as a, uh, a slash n okay it is instead of slash n so now uh, of course you know it, it acts as a printf okay C out acts as a printf okay printf enter your name now you have to take the input normally for taking input you will use scanf but here you are using c in c in means console in okay console input operation so normally uh, there is a difference in c in and c out normally c in it will be outwards but here it will be inwards you can see over here the sign is different you can see that is this sign is different this sign is different out means outputting and here it is inside that is greater than symbol of course uh, two times c in so i am taking a, a variable like a variable uh, so i'll name uh, give as a uh, name okay i'll give the variable as name and semicolon okay uh, it was showing that a name is uh, undeclared or undefined so i will define that so we will define it as care okay care name and uh, i will uh, uh, give a size of uh, 10 okay i'll give a size of 10 and I'll end it so now the error is gone the name error is gone if underline is there means there is error so now after this again uh, see you have taken the input that is name you have taken now what should I do uh, I should print it okay how should I print it so you will use printf so in C so in C++ you are using C out okay C out again redirection symbol you are redirecting to the output so what I should print well, very simple I should print name I should print name and again I will use uh, redirection and end L end line okay so this is the way I will print it okay so everything is done here so first line is IO stream dot H uh, I'm not using IO stream and namespace std int main and uh, int main I'm using and afterwards I'm uh, uh, declaring name uh, with the size of uh, 10 okay size I'm giving as 10 so C out 
uh, that is to print something enter your name and end line is uh, uh, acts as slash n in, uh, in c okay uh, in normally in c you will use slash n here end line c in that is you are taking a name okay c in you are taking name as input okay so you can see the change in symbol this one and again here to output and finally you will give the end line so let me uh, compile this okay i will save this and i'll compile debug start without debugging okay would you like to build yes uh, click on yes and enter your name okay i'll give so what what is my name okay i'll give us arjun okay i'll press enter you can see it is printing arjun okay it is printing arjun so it's very simple a uh, program or uh, whatever the name you give it will print the same okay you will give arjun means it will give arjun i'll give something else uh, yes uh, start without debugging i will give uh, yes um, aj i will give aj i'll press enter it will print aj okay so uh, it will take input and it will display it okay instead of uh, care can i use something else of course you can use string also okay instead of uh, uh, care you can use a string so let me change here so instead of character uh, i will use a string i will use string so it will show uh, for string there is no need of for this one so again it will uh, show some error no operator underline is there no operator because the string is declared inside a header file you know what is that okay ash include i should uh, declare one more header file ash include uh, uh, string dot h uh, okay uh, just you can see over here see there are two things uh, over here string and string dot h anyhow in c++ uh, string is enough no need of string dot h uh, that is enough that will understand itself so string i'll close it and now you see there is no error underline uh, that errors is gone now so i will save it okay and i will debug the program start without debugging yes okay so again enter your name okay i'll give uh, something else uh, i'll give my name is what okay uh, shreyas okay i'll press uh, enter it is shreyas okay so now uh, you can write the program in many ways okay you can use character you can use strings to uh, you know you can use anything whatever you want string or character so now i will give i will tell you what is the importance of std i told what is the importance of std okay i'll comment this okay i'll comment this uh, comment line you know if i do like this it will be the comment line see um you can see here there are errors three errors are there a string unidentified c out unidentified c in unidentified because string c out and c in is declared inside std that is why it is showing error okay that is why it is showing error how can i remove this error i can use some other uh, ways to uh, declare this okay instead of std i should declare uh, wherever string is there wherever c out is there wherever c in is there i should declare std in front of that so uh, it's very simple std okay here you are using scope resolution operator this is called scope resolution so now see the error is gone because string is declared inside std string is declared inside std so that is why it is it was showing errors error okay now again uh, i i should remove c out how can i remove that it's very simple std again scope resolution operator c out okay so error is gone again for this std uh, scope resolution operator again uh, c in error is gone again c out again it is showing error std colon uh, uh, scope resolution operator see the all the errors is gone now uh, again i'll uh, save it and i will uh, uh, start without debugging okay i'll give my name uh, uh, still there is some errors undeclared identifier ndl yes ndl is also uh, declared where in std okay again std so again 
uh, here also again std okay that is why it is showing error i haven't seen that i'm sorry for that okay uh, see uh, everywhere i have declared std 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 because endl is declared inside uh, std endl even c out is declared inside std string is declared inside std c out c in everything okay now i'm going to save it and i'll going to debug it and uh, we'll see whether there is an error uh, no there is no error that's good okay enter your name i'll give you my name arjun okay i'll press enter it is displaying arjun so as simple as that i hope you understood what is the use of std okay so if you put this one line no need of uh, uh, doing all those things okay sorry uh, uh, these things no need everywhere std 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 uh, no need so this single line is enough okay uh, thank you for watching my video thank you so much and uh, don't forget to share subscribe and like thank you